some Tom and rubbish. Nah. Nah, blood. Nah, I'm doing, um, I don't know, brethren. They just, all they said is you've got to come to this room. I'm in the room now, brethren. There's, there's cameras. There's, I'm in a studio of some sort, but I don't have a clue. I don't know if they set me up, brethren. Hey, listen, yeah, I'm going to go, yeah, because I just want to see what I've got to do. So I'm just going to sit down for a minute and um, see what I want. But, brethren, this don't feel right. Yeah, listen, yeah, I just need to do some reflection based on what you just said. So, yeah, I'm going to call you later, yeah? All right, all right, cool. All right, bye. Yo, what's this? Hello? Can you hear me? You! Green flashing light person. Can you hear me? Oh, it's like that, is it? You're lucky. If I knew what it was, trust me, I'd have just mash it up right now, but I don't know what it is. Why are you interesting? Are you listening? Nah, man. Man's not saying nothing. Oh, you want to hear something? Because I see the flashing. So there's somebody behind it, yeah? Yeah, you. Oh, you want to know something, yeah? What am I thinking and feeling right now? Well, we just come from stuff going on out there, so I might as well talk about it if you don't want to speak to me. Is there any microphones in the place? Okay. I'll tell you, yeah? Code of the streets. Dr. Martin Glynn, a.k.a. Doc Martin. Me, code of the streets. Are you listening? You see me? I can take you to a place people don't like walking. You have to watch your step in the area you are talking. You don't have money, so you have to hustle. You need a clever brain and not a rippling muscle. Pushing all your selling involved in prostitution. The muggers, pimps and pushers become an institution. Mashing up on crack. Calm your brain on weed. Ripping off your people filled with foolish greed. One parent, family, mothers, a new bought pram. In the evening, leave the children to make the party ram. Sexual promiscuity, the debt is being paid. Dying very slowly, the price you get is AIDS. Learn to shoot a pistol, know how to survive, raving in the party till the policemen they arrive. Yeah. I can take you to a place where you can see high rise, where suicide is normal and never bring surprise. Where filth and dirty living is a really ugly head, there's nothing to get up for, so you stay most days in bed. Sign on once a fortnight. The dough you were getting. And if it don't come, you really start fretting. People stay indoors. They don't go out at night. Because they're frightened of a beating and dying in a fight. It's a hopeless situation. Submerged in the crap. Society makes the rules. You get caught in the trap. You can find a way out because you think you're a man. You need some hustling money, so you formulate a plan. Meet up with your friends, decide to do a job. You put your minds together, because you're going to rob. In the panic of the robbery, another man lay dead. Yet another pressure. To put inside your head. It's the type of situation that most of us ignore. It's expanded every day, could even reach your door. Now to understand my rhyme, you really must be willing to think before you act. By that I mean chilling. I know you are frustrated and life is complicated. But prison ain't no good because you'll get separated from your family and your friends, your children and your lover. And with a long sentence, she's due to find another. You see, 
Fighting is a course we all have to pursue. But robbery ain't the answer. There's other things to do. Like education, independence, learning and achievement, bettering yourself. These things are important to the freedom and the justice that is owed to you and me, written by our people in our history. Freedom fighting is the answer, and not just selfish greed. You are needed in the struggle to follow or to lead. The principle is simple. The future may be grim. Fight the system or sink or swim. But an action, a reaction, can bring no satisfaction when money is the motive, the fatal attraction. So, the seeds of change are blowing if society keeps going. Rebellion, rebellion, rebellion will come as the streets, the streets, the streets, the streets, the streets are now showing. Yeah. So whoever you are, whoever you may be listening, that's the code in the streets. That's what's going on. That's county lines. That's knife crime. That's people killing each other. That's for people on food banks. This is for Grenfell. This is for everybody who's struggling who has no voice. So whoever you are listening, understand me. Forget CNN, BBC One, Channel Four, Dr. Martin Glynn, a.k.a. Doc Martin, a.k.a. Urban Storyteller. And when everybody hears this, maybe when they're out there, maybe when they do something about it, you'll understand the code of the streets. Because in that movie, you will be playing the starring role. So, hold on. Yeah? Yeah, Bredgen, I've done, you know. I'm not really staying here too long. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. I just needed to speak to someone. You understand me? No, I'm cool. I'm cool. I think they got the message. Yeah, yeah, give me 15. All right? All right, we're gone. Take care. Bye. Yo, you just remember what I said, yeah? Code of the streets. Oh, yeah, one last thing. You might come to my house and arrest me. Lock me up. But the beauty about technology is I'm going to become immortal because once this lands on YouTube, Deezer, Spotify, iTunes, you can kill the messenger, but you can't kill the message. Take care. And...